guys, it's Dear Natural 62. I'm coming today with another great beauty tip just for you. It's on buffers. If you ever noticed, these are two different types of buffer. This is a long, thin buffer, and this one is a square, the typical buffers that you would see. When you're doing nails and you're using a buffer, this big buffer sometimes can be cumbersome. So, and you don't want to waste your buffer because you go through them so quickly. So, I learned a great tip in beauty school that I'm going to share with you. Starting with this one, if you cut them at smaller, you can cut them a little bit smaller and you can cut them different sizes because it still works the same. I'll show you right now. It does the same trick. I use the buffer in an X motion, going this way, that way, this way, that way, and it works perfectly fine. And using a bigger size does the same thing. This way, you'll save money because you've cut them smaller, cut them to the size that you want, and it's just easier for you to use. So with these regular size buffers, if you if you take a nice sharp knife, you can slice them down to different sizes. Now, if you're of a certain age, I'd probably ask your mom or an adult to do this for you. I'm basically just doing this on a cardboard with a piece of plastic. This way I don't damage the surface of my countertop or my table, and I don't scratch or damage anything. Just ask an adult and they'll be happy to do this for you, especially when they realize how much money you're saving them because you've cut them down to a smaller size. And you can use this side to buff, or you can use even a smaller side to buff. And you still have all the sides. And once you're done, here's another neat thing that you can do with your buffers. Now, once your buffers are worn, because they do tend to get worn, this is all you do. Flip them on the other side on a flat bed, I have these random nail arts and a lot of time I like to be inspired so I go back and I look at my random nail arts that I've done in the past. Now if you want to display them, here's another cute way to display your nail art. Just stick them in, standing up, stand the taller ones in the bigger one, the little one in the... So just look how we were able to reuse our old buffers. I love to recycle things and this is just another great way to recycle an old buffer. So I hope you've enjoyed this. It's Dear Natural 62. Don't forget to subscribe to both my YouTube channels, Dear Natural 62 and Dear Natural. More videos to come and I'll also let you guys know where I'll be headed so you we can meet up. So definitely, thanks for being a DN fan. It's Dear Natural 62. Take care. Bye-bye.